Hey y'all, how you doing? Well, it's the same day. Get off of there. Get down. Sorry, damn cats. This is the same day that I uploaded the Ace Off uh, video. Move that over. So I wanted to show you all some cool things that I picked up from Ross the other day. It's not much, okay? But I just want to show you all this. If you have never looked at a video, I am CC. This channel is called CC's Fashion is my passion. I do plus size fashion for the plus size woman, but I do show things that I buy out of retail stores such as Ross, TJ Maxx, Marshalls, Burlington, Family Dollar, Dollar Tree, so forth and so on, okay? So, let me show you all. Get down. Get down. So let me show you guys what I picked up from Ross the other day. First thing I picked up was this. I'm not, I don't know if you all are familiar with this brand. It's called Tate's Bake Shop Cookies. These are the chocolate chip. You see the bag is empty. You get two containers like this okay and the cookies are very very thin a very thin cookie with chocolate chips in it get out that bag hold on you are get out this bag get out so the, the cookies are very thin Okay, that's what the cookies look like. These are the chocolate chip ones. Oh my God, are they good? They are so good. So these are the chocolate chip. And then I picked up these. Now my coworker had these and she gave me a package. And good. These are also tape cookies. So you get... These are the lemon, okay? Those for the chocolate chip. Again, another thin cookie. Oh, they smell so good and they so buttery. Oh, they taste so good, you all. So I've already eaten a few out of this package. And this is what they look like before you open them. So, let's see. How many cookies do you get? Uh, it doesn't say. So, one, two, three, four, five. So, you get seven cookies in each package. If you have never, ever, ever tried a Tate cookie, please look for them in Ross. I've never seen them in TJ Maxx or Marshalls or Burlington, but T but Ross has them, okay? Ross, R-O-S-S. -S. If you've never been in that store, if you have a store in your hometown, trust CC on this. You know I don't never steer you all wrong. Get you some Tate cookies. Girl, they do. So I'm gonna tell you all how much they were. They so good. They so lim these these are so they smell like lemon. These are the lemon. Yep, these are the lemon cookies. Okay, and they were five ninety nine. Okay, compared value. Well, they don't have a comparable. They don't have a compared value. Well, girl, this little bag right here are these Tate cookies. My lord. So good. See if I can get a thumbnail. So good. Get you some cake cookies. Um, and I do believe the chocolate chip ones, they were $5.99 too. My fave. My favorite. All right, so moving right along. I also picked up these. These are Roca Bites. They are chocolate bites. Let's see if you can see what they look like. Let me put this. Let me put that down. 
that's what they look like very very good they're real tiny delicious um they are milk chocolate little butter crunch bites that's what they are good these were three dollars and 79 cents and it looked like these are the people who are responsible for these little roca bites 100 percent sustainably sort coco caraco they good milk chocolate so good get these okay so that's the food items now we're gonna go and I'm going to show you some smell goods that I picked up. Something that I found in Ross that I had never seen before. This. I had never seen Vaseline Total Moisture Body Wash for clean and nourished skin. You get a big ounce of this. This is 33.8 uh, ounce. It has the pump came with it. It smells so good. It smells good. You see how thick the uh, soap is. So you're going to get a lot of washes out of this. I buy body wash so much because Chris and I, we take showers so much. Okay, I, I, I take a shower almost take a shower twice a day in the morning and in the evening okay that's just me in the summertime same thing because i sweat with this menopause i just i don't feel clean because i sweat so i take a lot of showers so this was 8.99 uh there's no comparable value but this is the vaseline total moisture body wash and i'm assuming it's made from the brand Vaseline. But I'm going to try it and let you know how it was. But it has nothing in it. So no um, preserve, you know, anything that's going to break your skin out. Healthy skin is clean and nourished skin. Vaseline Total Mo Moisture Body Rat Wash uh, range actively nurtures your skin, leaving it soft and smooth. So I'm going to try it. This is the first time I'll be trying this brand, and I'll let you know. Second thing I picked up is Dove. I love all of Dove scents. This happens to be one of my favorite. This is the um, Cucumber and Green Tea. I always go to Ross and buy body washes because they are so reasonable. This one is 24 ounces. And it was $7.49. For this particular body, body wash, I have gone other places and it's more, about eight or nine dollars, depending on, you know, for this this size anyway. I love, love dove. Oh, it smells so good. Another brand that I like from Dove is the uh the coconut. I can still smell it. I took a shower this morning, not too long ago. Well, no, I took a shower about 8.30 this morning. It's a little bit after 12. It's a little bit after 12 o'clock in the afternoon, and I can still smell it. One thing about Dove, if you ever bathe in Dove, you bathe in the morning, you will smell clean and refreshed all day long. Dove really sticks with the body and Dove does not break me out. And so if you're a person who has some issues with your skin, get Dove. And if you're a person who can't use different scents because of whatever reason, because you have eczema, then I would suggest just getting a regular Dove. 
um because the just the regular dove smell good but they it lasts on your body so long and i like that i like the fact that i can smell the soap on me all day long the wind blow i smell myself you know what i'm saying i love taking showers and i love taking showers and good smelling fragrances that really lather, lather up and it's really going to stick to my skin and last all day so this is the Vaseline one, and this is the Dove, okay? So this one I've never tried, but it smells really good. This one I know for sure is going to work. Okay, so that's this. Put that on the couch. The next thing I picked up was some lashes. Y'all know I buy lashes all the time. And these are the Poppy and Ivy Beauty Darling Lashes Assorted Collections. So with this one, um, you get the bigger lashes at the bottom. And then from the top going down, you know, if you don't like big lashes, these are nice. Because you get the smaller ones and then the next size. Okay, so I love my lashes. And these were... Price on them? Oh, they were $8.99. Okay, $8.99. Compared value $16. And you get eight pair. So for eight pair of lashes, I thought that was pretty good. I've gone other places, other beauty supply stores, and they have the, the, a bundle like this. They want to charge you about $12 or $13. Exactly what this says on here. $16. That's that's usually about how much they cost. Okay, the next thing that I picked up was this. I have something like this already in black. I have been looking for another one of these, okay? Um this is um it's called turtle turtle fur. So how you put this on, I'm not going to put it on because I want to mess up my hair. You take this part and you put it over your head and it stays close to your neck. So if you are a person who work outside for a living, sometimes a scarf don't, won't stay close to your neck, around your neck and keep your neck warm. This will. I like this fabric because this fabric is real stretchy so it'll be easy to get over your head. It's very breathable. And I got this on sale. It was reduced to $6.49. So I don't know how much it originally was. But as you see, they've got the little tag on here, the turtleneck. And then this part up here, you pull it over and it'll keep your head warm. So you've got two things. You've got a neck, something close to your neck to keep you warm. Plus you have a hat. Okay, I have a black one. I love it. My black one is much, the material is much thicker than this one. So when I saw this one, I was like, yes. As a person who works outside, I am always looking for things that are warm, but are comfortable and are not difficult to get on. Okay. And so I'm always looking for stuff all the time. And I like this because it does have the stretch material. I love that. Um, so when I saw it, I was like, oh, I need to get it again. And it says project warmth. And like I said, I got it reduced for $6.49. You go on Amazon and you look for these. They cost way more than $6. And even whatever the original price was on here, I don't know what it was. I still know that it probably was not a lot. And they got the tag, so I can't, I, I can't see what it was. But I love this. Love it. Love it. And last but not least, I picked this up. A sweatshirt it's not any sweatshirt it is a Carhartt if you familiar with Carhartt you buy this sweatshirt anywhere else you're gonna spend about 
40 to 50 bucks because it's Carhartt. And you know, Carhartt is work gear. I have another Carhartt sweatshirt from uh, Ross as well. It's a light lavender color. And I showed it to you all, I do believe, in another haul. So when I went in there and I saw this one in blue, I was like, I got to get it because I do work outside for a living. It is thick. Here's the Carhartt tag. It was $19.99. The compare value was $28. But I know that if I go to any uh, work, out, uh, work gear store, I'm gonna pay more for that. For this uh, sweatshirt, it has a hood and a functioning draw drawstring with the silver. Well, these are not silver, but with the little tabs at the end. I love Carhartt sweatshirts. When I tell you they keep you warm, they are comfortable. If you wear this sweatshirt, you're not going to have to put another shirt on up under this because it's not light. It's not real, real heavy, but it's heavy enough that you could just put that sweatshirt on and just throw you a jacket on. Or if you want to view a person that work outside and you like to have on a sweatshirt, but then a vest over it, this is that kind of sweatshirt. Nice sweatshirt. And the inside of the sweatshirt has this fleece. Very, very soft. I love it. I love it. So when I saw this one in blue, I was like, okay, I got to get that. And it does have the kangaroo pocket in front. So if you want to put your phone in here or your keys, you can do that as well. And it also gives you a little side pocket right here. It's a little pocket down in here. You can put like some Carmex or lip gloss down in this little pocket. You can't beat it, you all. Do not sleep on Ross. I keep telling y'all, don't sleep on Ross. You will find so many different things in Ross. And I just love, like I said, I love, they got the little Car Carhartt um, emblem right here. If I could find all of the Carhartt sweatshirts, I would get them all because that's how much I like them because I have a lavender, um, a light, like I said, a light pink lavender one, and it says Carhartt across it. Love them. All right, you all, that ends this haul. It was short, quick, sweet, and, to, and simple. I just wanted to show you some things that I picked up. I try to come on and show you all things that I find, things that I think that you might want to have just your everyday life. So, th so that's what this haul was. It wasn't a lot of stuff, but it was a it was some good stuff. That's the that's the magic word. It was some good stuff. Ross didn't have a lot. I didn't see a lot, but um, I wasn't in there that long either. I went on my lunch break, ran through there real quick, went over to the clothing, picked up some of those items, and I was out the door. Okay. So I hope that you saw something in this Ross haul that you yourself can use, or maybe your husband, your wife, your friend, a family member. You know. Pick you up some stuff and you're not breaking the bank. I think, um, I don't have my receipt, but I think I spent probably about $67, something like that. Not a whole lot, but you know, Ross is my store. I love me some Ross. I don't like all of them. You have to go, I have to go to the particular ones to get what some time to find what I want. All right, you all. Have a good day. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.